Let's take a look at temperature. Now temperature is measured in degrees and the unit for measuring temperature is degrees Celsius and degrees Fahrenheit. Now Fahrenheit is quite rare, particularly in the UK, we almost never use it. The only people who talk about um, temperature in Fahrenheit are slightly older people like my mum who's in her 70s would talk about the temperature being 65 degrees Fahrenheit. But most of us, um, when we look at the weather app, it will give us the temperature in degrees Celsius. Um, Fahrenheit is used in America, uh, but pretty much everywhere else around the world, temperatures are measured in Celsius. Um, a few key temperatures, water freezes at zero degrees Celsius. So when you see ice on the roads, that's because the air temperature has dropped below freezing, so below zero degrees. And when you see steam coming out of your kettle, that's because the water has reached a temperature of 100 degrees, which is boiling point. So if we do take a look at um, a scale of zero degrees Celsius to 100 degrees Celsius, so uh, boiling point when water turns to steam is 100, water freezes, so turns to ice at zero degrees. Um, the temperature of the human body should be 37 degrees. Uh, when you have a fever, you, your temperature will go up to 38, 39, um, but which is obviously not healthy, but healthy body temperature is 37. A nice day in, in Britain is generally between 20 and 32. For some people, 32, that is definitely getting a bit uh, unbearably hot. Um, but generally in the UK, the temperature most of the year is probably between 12 and 20 during the day. And in the winter months, it starts to get a bit uncomfortable between zero and 12. So it's good to have a general idea of what's cold and what's hot. And again, you can see that it's measured in degrees Celsius.